Next, what I'm going to do at this point, I'm going to call my friend Rick Belson up to the dais here, up to the podium, sort of podium, and um, I'm going to ask him to uh, make a presentation that uh, we think is very important and is, uh, I would say, long overdue. So Richard, you want to come up here and, uh, and take over? Good evening. Once again, it's a pleasure to be here with you. And it's just such a very special occasion, the second symposium. We've learned a lot about the local history of uh, St. Augustine and how it ties in to the history of the 17th Fleet. And I was very nervous about coming here, of course, because when the survivors approached St. Augustine, they took all their treasure from them. <laughs> but anyway, uh, the treasure we have here is actually the human capital in the room. All the wonderful people here who have an interest in the 1715 fleet and in their own particular way have contributed to the history uh, of the fleet. And there's one person that we'd like to honor because uh, 2016 marked the end of an era in that it was the last issue of the publication of Plus Ultra magazine, which Ernie Richards has been publishing for 34 years. And it was one of the publications I first started reading when I got excited about the treasure for the second time back in 1996, as I mentioned. And I'm sure everyone here uh, has at one time or another been a, a subscriber. And it, it, it's something I always look forward to receiving four times a year. And uh, we'll miss it. Um, and anyway, we have some presentations for you. The first is a beautiful tile that uh, Ben had commissioned. And it's a special award presented to Ernie Richards in recognition of his many years of service in furthering the educational mission of the 1715 Fleet Society through the publication of the Plus Ultra newsletter. And I might add that Ernie also published Treasure Quest for a few years, and that was a great magazine. And it says here, Ernie, you are always the treasure on the Treasure Coast and the Plus in Plus Ultra. So. Hey. Okay. I, I have some. No. He's, he just gave me a kiss because I had shown him the t shirt and uh, he knows I'm from San Francisco. But anyway, um, what I have here is something else. Uh, Ernie's. Uh, nickname, did, did you come up with C-Scribe or did someone yeah, else? someone else did. Okay, well, uh, his, his moniker is Ernie C-Scribe Richards, and of course, a scribe needs to have a pen. So here is a uh, 1715 Fleet Parker pen. <laughs> It, it's complete with a Kip Wagner signed certificate. Wow. I never had one of these. Never came across one all my years. Show it to me. Wow. Ernie, show it. You, you could open it, maybe. Yeah. You can hold this. <laughs> oh, Joe Elastic and his rubber band. Yeah. <laughs> know them very well. There's a little ship inside. Oh. You got the certificate too. Down here, something signed by Kip Wagner. A couple of them. <laughs> Kip Wagner, the guy that started all this, you know? Kip Wagner, that's his signature? Two of them. You mean to give me two? That's how it came. <laughs> wow. Something about the Parker pen. So it just has the, the ink pen, not the, the ballpoint. I've never actually seen a ballpoint. Something's in that, But that's a cartridge. Oh, okay. And this 
Metal is from where? It's from this. It's one of the melted down uh, coins. Some of the coins, yes. Wow. Really cool. Smile. <laughs> You're supposed to go, you like me, you really like me. You want another kiss. <laughs> I don't kiss guys usually. <laughs> Look at that. Made out of 1750 silver. It will be on eBay tomorrow. <laughs> And uh, one, one more thing, Ernie. Uh, the, uh, the gentleman that did the talk also gave him this map, and it says, Ernie, you clearly have contributed so much to the history of the 1715 fleet. This is my small way of saying thank you, Warren Clark. So. I should have quit earlier. <laughs> Box mine too? Yeah. <laughs> Actually, uh, this was a box of chocolates. So, as Forrest Gump's <laughs> mother said, life is like a box of chocolates. You never know what you're going to find. <laughs> Thanks so much. This is unbelievable. I, I never expected this. Total surprise.